Hi guys, so today I'm telling you all about my lip clip. <laughs> Everyone says it's affecting my speech, but I can't really hear it. Um, so silly sausage, silly sausage. So we're gonna be talking about sizes now. So when I first got it done, I got this size, which is quite a bit different from what I'm wearing. So this size is a 12 and I got a round one because I thought, you know, round would be cute and round is cute. Then I went up to this little brass one. Then I went up to that. And then I got a brass one again, hammered brass. Then I got a round one, just a plain round one. Another plain round one, another plain round one. <laughs> another plain round one, another plain round one. And then my final form. <laughs> But I switched between the two of them because um, this one's got bigger wings on the back um, and this one has got like little wings on the back. Bear with me, I nearly dropped it. So you, as you can see the wings are quite small on it. And then we're starting to dig in, I didn't realise this for some reason. Um, and then the one I've got in at the moment... <laughs> Look at my skinny lips. <laughs> right, okay. Then the one I've got at the moment, oh, I've got these big fat wings on them. So these are my two 20 millimetres at the moment. They look quite different. Like my round one looks bigger for some reason. And then the wings at the back are quite different. <laughs> but this one's obviously the comfier one. But um, sometimes when I sleep, I stick my lip forward and um, this bit digs in a little bit. So I might have to send it back and get it curved here. But as you know, guys, coronavirus, so uh, most people aren't working. So I don't know if the boys are working at South Shore Ornaments at the moment. Adornments. Put that back in. <laughs> okay, so... That's what it looks like on the inside. But in my sleep, um, I think I'm doing this. And it's like resting against my gums on the inside. So I'm going to see what they can do. But at the moment, I'm just switching between that one and this one. Because this one doesn't feel too sharp on my gums. Um, but this one feels like it's digging into my lip. Mm. Right, how I clean them. So what I do is, um, when I'm brushing my teeth, I take my lip plate out. Lush. <laughs> I brush my teeth like normal. Then I brush the hole itself. I brush the outside of the hole. I mouthwash. And then I brush this. And then I dry my face. And I put it all back together again. Ta-da! <laughs> but yeah, this one's my favourite. And I don't think I'm going to go any bigger. Um, but the lip plate I originally got my lip cut for was like 22mm. And it was like my dream piece. And that's the whole reason I got my lip done. But um, I might stretch up to 22 I might not. But I could get it custom made to my size. So I'm not sure. Really. And my best friend said that the one that I like looks like a custard cream biscuit. <laughs> so yeah, guys, I sleep with the lip plate in. Otherwise, it might shrink if I don't. And then I'd have to go back down the sizes again and put them back up to the size that it was. Um, but yeah, I sleep with it in. It doesn't cause no problems. And I chose brass because it looks nice with gold. As you can see, I'm wearing gold. Um, I like gold in my ears but yeah brass is quite nice with gold until I can afford a massive gold piece the one that looks like a custard cream <laughs> so my lip plates came with this like brass polishing cloth yeah so it looks a bit mucky at the moment because I keep using it every day but I just like I either take the plate out and I give it a scrub or I leave it in my face and I give it a scrub yeah, sometimes it goes dull because I like slop my food all over. <laughs> but other than that, it looks cute. I prefer the round one to this one. 
but I'll show you what they both look like. So this is my round one. He's really cute. And this is my oval one, which is not as cute. I just like standard um, normal Emily. Emily that can talk a little bit easier. Doesn't have to pronounce my letters as much, but it's not my favorite. And as you can see, it's like digging in on one side. If you're wondering what that black is, I used to have a tattoo there and then, yeah, I don't have the tattoo there anymore because it's been cut. <laughs> so yeah, I wear this plate the most. And this is what this one looks like. Quite a large plate on the inside. But yeah, I don't think it affects my speech too much. But everyone keeps saying that it does on my TikToks. Even though they can't even hear me because I'm uh, lip syncing. But yeah. <laughs> Guys, last bit of the video. What everyone loves is to see me take it out and show you the hole. <laughs> don't know why people go crazy for this, but they do. So... That is me. Normal, normal lips. Looks strange, very strange. So the hole is a little bit red because of the scar tissue. I don't like my teeth, only because one's out of place, but my lip plate kind of covers that. Um, and then what everyone likes to see is this. Don't know why people like to see that. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. Mm, that's what it looks like on the out and for some reason people like to be like oh what can you stick through there so I can basically stick two fingers through there so that's my lip <laughs> um, and people always say why would you do this to yourself and I'm like because it looks cool like why else would you do it look guys this is me talking normal um, And this is me talking normal again, so I don't really see the difference between lip plate and no lip plate, but lots of people say that I've got a lisp. Oh, let's say that let's say that sentence again without the lip plate. Lots of people say that I've got a lisp. Lots of people say that I've got a lisp. <laughs> it's kind of cute though. Right, thanks guys for watching. Bye! Mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs>